again, you are, yeah, standard. You know I was filming, that's why, didn't you? I just did it for fun. That's what you do on road trips, isn't it? <laughs> Back to the road trip factory. We're on our way to Rocky Nuts up in the beef capital of Rockhampton. Cruising in the Iron Lion. Yeah, dog, KDM. And so far, so good. Yeah, the biggest problem so far is that it's bloody impossible to get fuel to go into this thing, which was always a problem with these wagons. We'll cover that later. <laughs> Very frustrating. Our first stop is we're heading up to Gimpy to drop off a FG manifold to which Gus is, Gus is coming with us on the weekend too by the way. Gonna get that thing powder coated and then we're meeting up with Mark and then we'll probably stop at probably Jin Jin or something, I don't know. But we're covering the whole weekend. Wherever it runs out of fuel. We're covering the whole weekend and we're in for a good time so stay tuned. First stop, Kalula sandblasting to deliver one of our barra plenums for. It's going in your drift car, right? Army life only. No barra crap. No barra? He doesn't like. Um, <laughs> doesn't like oil pumps. Hey, I got a question for you. Have you got a um, powder coating oven big enough for a chassis? I have one coming. Oh, there we go. How long? How long? Um, how long's piece of string? <laughs> <laughs> how long will it take you to finish the crown? <laughs> That's also a length of string. <laughs> uh, please take me to um, Torben Lee uh, BP service station, please, driver. Alright. Uh, got any money? Make it quick. <laughs> Show me the cash or get out. <laughs> Bloody God's country, Geordie, I tell you what. Big man, how are ya? Yeah, good. How are you going? Ready for a road trip? Yeah, I'm keen. Al is, Al's doing the old fuel shuffle here. <laughs> 17 litres so far. And it has a big fair lane going over there, Mark. Going good. Full, yeah? full of V85. Yeah, wicked. Have you got jerry cans to take with you? Nah, man. It, it'll 130 litre tank, it'll be fine. Oh, yeah, wicked. Sweet as. Scrutineering tent, which I don't know, line looks the same as any other event really. Long, weighted out. Make sure you've got a battery that's not falling out the bonnet and lights at work. We're not doing any events in the Kinga. Mark is doing off street drags, but I'm sorry, on street drags, whatever it's called, eighth mile stuff. So he's in a different line, but we're just here to have some fun and then cruise around. We've got the boys in the car. We've got some lemon squash in the back. 
and we're heading up to where are we going again? What's how, it called? How good is a six seater? At a so good. Like this, is what, this is what it's all especially, about. Especially one with a blown iron line in it. Hell yeah. Good morning, day two. Oh, well, officially day one of uh, Rocky Nuts 2022. We're in the Kinger. We had a coffee, we had some breakfast, and we are heading. Where are we going? going for a lap. Uh, I've got some mates to meet up, meet up with today and we've got the street parade on at 9.30 is the um, meet up time and I think 10.30 is when the street parade starts so hopefully we can get a whole bunch of crew in the car and we'll cut the biggest fat lap that Rockhampton has ever seen. Actually I'm pretty sure it's like Australia's biggest hot lap as are far you, as I'm aware. Are you fat shaming Rockhampton? I'm not fat shaming, it's called a fat lap. You can't you cut a hot lap. Got a big hottie. Stay tuned. Does anyone know a good mechanic that can get an indicator out? I don't work on these things. Neither man. do I. I'm like, I've taken the screws out. What more do you want from me? We just popped into Super Cheap, partly because we need an indicator globe, but also just because we wanted to say hello to the lads here because they sent us a message about uh, hopping in. So Mark wants to polish his car 18 times more. So um, we'll go and get some. Polishing rags or something. You know how these come out? Someone yeah. in the comments section. Here's a proper be mechanic. This is, this is Braden, he's a proper mechanic, not a fake YouTube mechanic like we are. Oh, the lens comes out. Oh, Alan. Yeah, dog. Next gen bulb, mate. It doesn't look blown though, so. Earth's loose. Yeah, that's electricity. Is. How does it work? <laughs> The end of the Allen key has got abrasive stuff on it. Look at you go. How's the mega zoom on the GoPro? <laughs> Count how many grey hairs I've got in my schnoggin. Can't really see them that well. You did it, Alan. Nobody knows the feeling of getting an indicator to work on an old car. It's the greatest, isn't it, Woody? Sure is, Alan. It's not as easy as you'd think. How good's this Tool Pro kit, though? It's got everything. Except pliers. Except pliers. That's the other kit. Pliers are sold separately. Nice car. We cruised on over to the street parade lineup. There's heaps of cars here. I don't know how many, but lots. Um, had a little bit of a hiccup on the way over. One of the cars overheated, and you guessed it, it wasn't the Kingswood. I don't know why, but the Kingswood should have overheated, and it doesn't. But the 1UZ, which is relatively modern comparatively, has had a bit of a spit. What's this? Uh... Oh, I just pulled that out because it fell off because it got so hot. But uh, <laughs> the, it was actually leaking out of the radiator, so I just had a quick look and the drain bung's fallen out of the radiator. So that will definitely do it. <laughs> so I'm about to handball the fix job on that off to Braden because he's a mechanic and I'm not anymore. So I'm pretty happy about that. We'll try and get that sorted, but I'd say she's probably going to stay here. Where's Where's Braden? Where's he going? I don't know. He's off getting a coffee and trying to avoid. Man, this thing's tidy. Mark, just like you could eat off his engine, mate, couldn't you? It would be polishes everything. You could cook stuff on it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we progressed a little bit. We had to get the radiator out to get the bung out. This is a problem here. That's the hole, which was actually this little. Don't know where I put it. That's what was left of it. You see that. So, ready to get it back in. Al's on his way back with a bungholio and some coolant from Super Cheap, and we'll be ready to go in, in time for the street cruise. Get it done. So you, Braden. Hang on, I'll put this somewhere. You've heard of Lemon Squash Racing Oil, now introducing Lemon Squash Racing Coolant. Now with quality assured Super Cheap Auto Lemons. So how many seconds have we got left before we have to start driving, Woody? Um, we had a bit of a conflict, there hasn't been a punch up just yet, but we're running behind schedule and the customer's really was, upset with us. I was going to punch up with you before when you are criticising my sump plug washer that I bought. Yeah, well, Do you know how long I had to freaking sit in traffic to get that? You weren't rolling around in bindies, bro. I had to bribe the officials to let me back into the joint. Don't you know who I am? <laughs> yeah, I did. I had to pull out my 
and they said, no, I don't know who you are, go away. <laughs> and I missed out the lady that wanted her boobs signed. Hey, Golby. I know you're on holidays, but have you got a 12 by 1.5 bung in stock? <laughs> <laughs> Just call Denver. <laughs> How you going? How's your weekend been? Yeah, good. Yeah, having fun? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah so far so good. That's it. Street parade and then you guys doing burnouts or drags or anything? Nah. Nah, just cruising around? Yeah, we Keep could. It for road trips. Yeah, hell yeah. Wait, 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 road trips like One a month time. away. Yeah. yeah. Awesome. Keen. That's going to be so sick. Yeah. Wicked. All right, have fun. Enjoy your weekend. Good day. Brad, John, Gary, Ben, Gary. How are you? How are you, bro? Good, man. Still waiting, bro. Still waiting. I've already been outside a lot. There's uh, the cars are rolling out now. We've got um, quite a few. What is going on in here? Hey, hey Woody! <laughs> hey! Richo's Customs, supercharged and turbo, the mighty AU. Some sick cars getting around there, just starting to. We've, the whole paddock's gone out so far, and we're at the end here, so. Some awesome cars. Oh, how's the VS Ute there? Dang. Real quality cars here. It's absolutely spectacular. Let's do a walk around. We've fixed the fair lane, we think. We're not too sure. Hopefully we have anyway. Look at this VL ethyl spec. Yeah, nice. Hey mate, nice car. A little bit of steez on you, you reckon? <laughs> nice car, man. All right, well, I'm gonna walk back to the fair lane now and line on up because we got the. Hey boys, how are you? My mate used to have one exactly this color. Yeah, I had yeah. one too. I wanted it the same. I bought like two grand from town years ago. Jeez, nice. Love an FC. They're awesome, eh? Yeah. Oh, even better, even better. We've been waiting a few hours now and we're finally jumping onto this, onto the, is it called a city cruise? What is it? Street parade. Street parade. We're in with Blake and his nice, really nice patinaed C10, uh, air conditioning and all. So it's very well suited for this kind of cruise. And we're right behind the Kinger and the Fairlane. The Fairlane, we think we fix it, but it might need to be touched up again later so we'll just see how we go Look at all these people here it's just crazy these cars i can't believe it there's so many cool cars here rocky sure knows how to turn it on the spectators here is crazy i can't believe it everyone's pulled up on the side of the road giving us a wave kids are getting high fives it's awesome to see Oh, matchy, matchy, matching. You should have told me because I would have brought mine. Bruh, you're supposed to bring it to every event. Yeah, shout out to Ali. Was it Ali who yeah. bought us that? Legend? Is it hard to change now? Well, it's cool. We'll have to glue that in, I reckon. Yeah. Got I reckon you stripped it. I haven't got it. Mark's changing over his wheels this morning. Morning, boys. How are we? What's up, man? For the workshop team. Tool Pro for the win. What time do you drag today, Mark? 12 o'clock. 12 o'clock. Yeah, okay, cool. So, off-street, on-street drags. We should have, we should have entered that, that would have been cool. Alright, day three, Rocky Nuts. As you can hear, there's some drifting on. We've got Gussie a ticket from Drift Cadet. Let's go check it out. Gassi 
She's out here now. Fun. Yeah. Went in the 86. Yeah. It was such a good time. Yeah, they were hard, supercharged too. They sound weird, don't they? Sound so good. They sound good. You got pretty close to the old man. It was a good drive yeah. too. Yeah, no spin outs. It was yeah. so good. Yeah, sick man. Uh, we'll have to convert the Libby to rear wheel drive. Sounds like a plan. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, righto boys, what we're dealing with over here is a 304 iron line, nice Harrop supercharger on the top there. Check her out. Yeah, 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 mate, it's a 304, it's just a stock rebuilt one, eh? Look at those Harrop blowers on the top, it's a nice one. All right, I popped down through the four drive area. There's some pretty skids cars going on down here. Pretty crazy to see. There's a lot of cool stuff going on. It's GQ, Shorty. LS Turbo, this thing's pretty wild. GU4. Hey, what's going on? How are ya? GU4, compound setup on a, is that a 1HD FTE? Nice, nice. This, uh, some Flexi 79 thing going on, Barra converted. This thing's on Instagram, I'm sure you've all seen it before. Patrols, some comp truck thing that's pretty crazy. Duramax setup, absolutely crazy going on down here really cool to see some four wheel drives around town and getting amongst the event too hey uh can you take me for a hot lap later in your Mate, seat or sure what can. <laughs> <laughs> oh biggie td 42 look at this stuff i swear rocky's like the four wheel drive central here most of these guys are all like running robinson suspension and apparently this is a guy this is the car to check out. Old Russell's GQ Shorty is from way back. Used to win competitions left, right and centre. It's a uh, sequential TB... Is it a TB45 or 42? 45. TB45. Uh, 48 With a 48 crank? Yeah. Yeah, okay. So Russell's just like a wizard. He's been playing around, playing around with this stuff for years on end. So he's got some weird sequential. There's a valve down the bottom there. Yeah, really impressive to see and very fast and capable car. So hats off to you, Russell. I've heard a lot about you, mate. Cheers. down to the street drags but unfortunately you can't really see much unless you're a VIP so I've jumped in with some mates hey bud oh, no 
mate. I was just taking a picture of your Kingswood with mine in the background, mate. That's all. So you've got a real one over there. Is it Paddy? Is it a Cadillac? Yeah. <laughs> it's a Kingswood, mate. It's the first time GM ever used the word Kingswood. So what? 59 Chevy Kingswood. Oh, I didn't even realise. These ones are pretenders, mate. Oh yeah. <laughs> I love that. I love that dicky seat in the rear. Is awesome. Yeah, she's different, eh? Oh, beautiful. <laughs> Cheers, mate. Nice pretend Kingswood, mate. Yeah. That's like, that's that <laughs> one one of those cheap knockoffs. <laughs> I've jumped in the car with some mates, Billy, Michael and Jess, we're going for a cruise. I need some fuel, we're getting pretty low, and I think we're going to head over to the burnout pad and find a cold lemon squash, because it's hot, oh. the seats are hot from sitting in the sun, and we're on the cruise route now, so this is a cruise route, cut a, cut a, a hot lap, a fat lap, have Tough some eat. fun. Tough lap? <laughs> fat lap's way better, I love the word fat lap. Am I paid after? <laughs> <laughs> Hey, that's not a lamb and squash. Hey, that's not a. Hey, that's not a lamb and squash. <laughs> oh, I see the problem, mate. You need some. Yeah, le you need some yeah. lemon squash racing oh, oil in there, mate. Oh, no. that's why. All right. Yeah, Here, just give you a little top, top up for you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just wait, just wait. Here it goes. You guys haven't heard of Richo's Customs before? Check him out. What's going on, uh, man? Look, we had a slight minor issue on the first burnout. We know he's a medium. Ended up in flames. Be really? Like <laughs> <laughs> so, everything caught fire. Um, we have pulled all the melted wires out, all the melted plugs, and we've heat, as you see, aircraft grade <laughs> heat on everything. So, hopefully, it won't burn and catch on fire again. So. All right, good luck to you, man. Thank you. I'll link your channel in the corner, dude, because keep. You, I love the channel. Keep up the good work. Thank you. Get that for you, sir. Thanks, man. How are you, man? What's going on? Not much. YouTube, meet Jamie. Jamie is the face behind Raceworks, uh, sponsor of the show, and really help us out, man. Cool to hang out. Thanks. Having Woody. a good weekend or what? Yeah, it's yeah. been good. I haven't been able to see much. There you I've been go. Standing still for the day, but uh, now we're we'll coming to see some elite cars. Let's go and have a look now. Yeah, that's it. All right, Jamie, forgot to lock the, the king of door. Right. Don't you know old cars, man? Come on. Uh, we're heading into the elite hall now, so we have just. Met up with Sam from Building Up Fort and we're gonna come suss some stuff out. So he's doing a video too, camera on camera. Suss out some cars. If you wanna see more of this stuff, check out uh, Rocky Nats or Summer Nats YouTube channel and also Overtaking Lane. I'm gonna link it, link in the corner there. Overtaking Lane have done a mad, mad video on the whole event here too, so definitely check them out. All right, there's a bit of music going on in the background, so I'm gonna keep it talking. Got some very nice cars here. These four cars here were unveiled last night. Um, this XT is absolutely immaculate. This is such a nice car. Very well done. Uh, LC Tirana, I believe, until I look at the front. LC Tirana. Again, very nice. Like, look at that engine bay in there. 
which is absolutely spectacular. No, come on, man. We're gonna Reckon get. Reckon am I good enough singing no. to make it copyright? No, we're, we're never on the copyright going. Oh, look who it is. Hey, how are you? What's going on, Woody, mate? How's the mo? Well, mate, oh. 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 <laughs> Yeah, so look, we made a bet to lose a certain amount of weight. Long story is I lost 15 more kilos, which is 10% meant to make 12 and a half. You get a, if you don't make 12 and a half, you get a 10. Long, boring story short. Well, I'll swap the bid for the 10. Wait, can we get a 10 and a mo or what? No, nah, look, the tan photos last a lot longer than the, than, than the, the pictures without a mo. So, me and Undy's getting a tan, they ain't happening. All right, I'll keep on cruising, man. Good to see you around. Cheers, dude. Enjoy. Some of these bikes down the bottom here too. Also, oh, the sickest VL. This was at Summonats. Also, very fast car. I don't know what the PB is, but very well done. Some of these bikes here too are just crazy. The hours put into some of these things is insane. And really cool to see bikes on display because you're at a car event that you don't really get to see them. So this stuff's really cool. I've just drawn, I've just drawn his shot in the background there, walking around with the GoPro. Sorry, man. <laughs> Again, if you want to see this, these cars in detail, check out the Rocky Nats channel and also Overtaking Lane. They, they, they've covered this stuff day in, day out. They put in some, some huge hours into their videos, so jump over there and check them out. I am going to go back to find Jamie and I am keen for a lemon squash because it's that time of day. Oh, look at that sunset. Rocky turning it on with the sunset. It does look really Most good. Almost like being at home, mate. Alright, uh, I don't know if you can see me. We're gonna wrap it up there. We're going out for dinner. Uh, it's Sam's shout. Oh, there we, there we go, now. lighting. <laughs> Sam said he's gonna shout us the $100 seafood platter. Sounds good. Thanks, I, don't Sam. Need, I don't need seafood, but. <laughs> I don't know what's happening tomorrow, but we'll see you next tomorrow with um, some, maybe some burnouts, whatever's going on. Cheers. Well, Sam's a man of his word. We got the seafood platter for two. Your shout. Legend. Thanks, man. <laughs> made the finals for the for the elimination finals for the drag racing so we've snaked a mint spot about halfway up the strip where we can stand on the back of the kinger and get some shots because it's really hard to see just because of the amount of people here Woody's eating a breakfast of tofu burger for breakfast only the best for a fine athlete like myself indeed now we wait Absolute legend. 
I don't know how he did in the burnouts yesterday, but that car, hats off to him, it's so sick. Uh, what we've done is, Mark, he red lit, but it was a bit of a tree fail, so. He when didn't it, red light, the, the light was green, but yeah. I like, they didn't reset it from the last run or something. So you know, Mark just said, the lineup's massive, we're not gonna line up for another five hours to do the same thing. There's faster cars than him, he's not gonna win. He's like, I'm going drag racing soon anyway. So when, when is that? A couple of weeks, isn't it? Anyway. We're going for a hot lap now, and then I get some lunch or something. And we can do the summer out big foot can. It's pretty picturesque cruising up the CBD of Rocky and amongst all these trees, and there's all these sick cars. Speaking of sick cars, Gobies, yeah, boy. We're parked straight out the, in front of the pub. Do you reckon that's a sign? That's a perfect spot. <laughs> <laughs> At you go, seize a lime tree, no, right. corona in hand, <laughs> where's my knife? Blake gave us that knife mate, thank you Blake, you're a legend, it's already coming in handy. I told Blake I'd keep that for the rest of my life and I will. No, the house keys are in my pocket. Hey, um, Uber fare started, where about to be heading? Oh, the pub. The pub. Please. Okay. Yeah. Need, need some drinks. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's going to wrap it up for Rocky Nuts number two, 2022. We've had a blast, we're cutting one final hot lap, they're kind of packing up the, the fencing and everything now, so there's not much going on. The burnout, hey! Woo! The burnout masters are finished, I'm not too sure who won. As I said in the video though, check out some of Rocky Nats content. They've been here all weekend posting daily videos. Check out Overtaking Lane and all the rest of the Rocky Nats content on YouTube. Thanks for joining us for a bit of a vlog episode, we've had a heap of fun being here and we're looking forward to coming back next year with Another vehicle, with for sure. Fair lane. With my fair lane, hell yeah. Definitely keen for that. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next week. We'll see you next time. Cheers. Yo.